Well, Dewan, just about wherever you drove in the Bull City tonight, there was some kind of block party going on. We stopped at a few of them watching kids interacting with the police department, their families, those officers showing them the men and women behind the badges. You know these officers would have hit the streets for a ride with their newest fans if they could have. Instead, a walkthrough on the Durham police motorcycles would have to do. The kids not only know that they're, they're here for safety, but they're here also as friendly. Ashanti Ward walked over to this National Night Out event at Durham Police Headquarters with her kids and several others from the Edgemont Elms neighborhood just east of downtown. So this is a good thing for them to do right here outside and during the light festivities, the sunlight and the music and enjoyment for the kids. The biggest block party of the night was here, but more than 50 neighborhoods participated. We went to one in the Swans Mill neighborhood off Hebron Road in North Durham. It's our responsibility as residents to help the police. Shootings are up over the last year in the Bull City, though the number of homicides is about the same. Gun violence is so prevalent everywhere, right? Um, and I don't know that I can attribute it back to any one thing. I just know that it feels like and that some of our data shows that we are seeing it most commonly in our in our babies in our juveniles, you know, in our kids. Durham's chief Patrice Andrews said events like this are helpful to connect with the communities they serve and in turn for communities to see police in a different light. So there has to be a continuous amount of work being done. Um, I think what you'll see is that just by having these positive interactions, we start the conversations and discussions, especially with our kids. One of those kids was major brought today by his grandfather, David. I wanted to bring my grandson here just to show him the good that the police officers do. Not all police officers are bad, but believe me, most of them are good, and I'm a retired homicide detective from D.C. A retired homicide detective certainly would know. The chief also said that these types of events are great ways to recruit to show that being a police officer can be fun at times. The department here down more than 130 officers, Dewan, not including the incoming academy class, but this is something that we've seen nationwide. This department and others, they need more people.